looking for a big three points to try to galvanize or regalvanize this group after a couple of wins early on in this season. As kickoff tonight is brought to you by Proven IT, John Freeman officially gets us underway on the lakefront. Turn off the world and turn on the game. We're playing for three points and might just have a little bit of Major League Soccer history. We'll have the ball tonight. As she hosts, looking to find John Duran, brings it down beautifully. It's Duran and Coronel with an excellent save. Early in the first minute of the game, but here's she hosts over the top, beats Sean Nealis. Aaron Long doesn't come across, maybe gets a little bit lucky here with a touch, and it's on his left foot, and you see he scuffs it in the... Picked up an injury during training this week, and Spencer Ritchie had a head injury in training as well, so a few players missing from the team sheet tonight, as here's Fletcher after the turnover, going for goal. And the first save of the night for the 17-year-old Gaga Slonina. This will fall for Sekulic. Blocked by Fletcher. Penalty. And it's a penalty! And they're going to have a look at this. And a yellow card as well. VAR will definitely take a look. Jordan Shakiri. And the fire lead of 1 0. And who else other than their main man? Jordan Shakiri. Shakiri steps up. Cornell goes to his left. A little stutter step from Shakiri. Goes down the middle. And luckily, Tyler, he didn't hit this any harder. Because if he hits it any harder, as Ezra Hendrickson applauds the attempt. Decent looking ball in. Takes an awkward deflection. And it's Tom Edwards who claims it. Tries to. Now they're going to go to it there. Well, Tony, I'm with you. I'm free to go over and check, but... Now, was there a pick, maybe? And that's why the mark. Maybe we're looking at that. And Omsberg tried to come back and help him. Here's the call. No goal. It's offside. Well, that was a tight one. But no time to sit and talk about it. Look at Duran again. Shifty little move. Omsberg trying to track back. It squirts all the way through. Miguel Navarro with a timely touch there. As Ashley Fletcher was bearing down on him, and if that had gotten through, that's an easy tapping. Sent back in, and blocked by Gutierrez. And it's a race to the ball along with John Tolkien. Tolkien's the first to it. And he's going to get a yellow card, and he is livid. Christian Caceres with all sorts of moves. He's been playing some really good football as of late. Here's the Venezuelan again. Good-looking ball into the corridor of uncertainty. Wow. And the entire back line was uncertain. And it's going to be a yellow card for Shehos for descent. And Ezra Hendrickson is not happy about that. Then they can be a true title contender, but the goals still seem to dry up for them, for whatever the case may be, at home and, and in large stretches throughout the season. Well, Klimala came here from Celtic to do what Fletcher is here to do now. We're going to get a yellow card here after the play as Navarro... get some stat checks on it but maybe the shortest halftime in major league soccer history just three minutes and the second half is underway tyler terrence along with tony miola one nil to the fire jordan shakiri with the goal in the first 20 minutes or so so check up nicely for gutierrez and he's got edwards beat for pace the fire off and running led by brian gutierrez cutting it inside gutierrez good opportunity there Marlowe wanted to return the favor. It'll fall for Luquinhas. And now Red Bulls are off and running. Barlow holding his run. It's Tom Barlow saved by Slonina and cleared away by Shehos. Ball to that far post. Gabby Slonina holds his ground. There he is onside there. Luquinha skipping away from Pineda, going for goal, and certainly had the interest of Slunina for a moment. He loves that little outside of the right foot shot. That's exactly how he scored against Orlando. Shifty play out on the wing from Dylan Nilas. Feeds it through for Luquinha, the Brazilian. Mauricio Pineda trying to defend. It's Clamala, and it's 1 1. Patrick Clamala with his first goal since week one against San Jose. And we very much have a game here on our hands at Soldier Field. He turns the corner. And look at Klamala peel off of Shehos here. Shehos has no idea. Augsburg tries to step out. 
Marquinhos here turns the corner on Mauricio Pineda, cuts it back, and Gramala with a clinical finish. It's Edwards, takes a deflection, and almost caught Gaga Slonina. It will be a corner, and now John Espinosa will come into the fray. Stoke Van, as this is whipped in again with plenty of venom all the way through. Now it's John Durant who has to chase it down. And Durant's called for the foul. He extended his arm, but the question is how much contact actually was there? And now Durant's going to go into the book. And that's his second. And he's done. I'm with you, Tony. If, I, that, I, if that's a yellow card, then what Fletcher did is definitely a yellow card. Yeah, I don't think either and, one of them are. And he, no, I don't think either one of them are either. He's playing some of his best football. A lot of players on Red Bulls right now are. Frankie Amaya, Omir Fernandez. That's a part of why they're in second place in the Eastern Conference as Shehos goes to ground. And if he gets a yellow card... He's going to get sent off here. He's going to get sent off. Now, this one for me is a different story. Yep, no, no question about it here. Shehos misses the tackle. So how deep can the fire dig to scrape out a point? With standing water littered all over Soldier Field, down two men. And Johnny Bornstein gets taken down by Dylan Nealis. Who's going to join Victor Becerra for a double substitution. Give up a penalty kick. There's a stutter step, a stop by Klimala. He continues his motion forward. Gabby Slonina goes too early. Byline. Can the fire pull something out of the hat here? Is Mauricio Pinedo elevated? And it will be a corner for the fire. Fire needs to get numbers back here. And that's going to do it full time. Red Bulls become just the second team in Major League Soccer history to win their first five games.